hello everyone um sorry i can't be with you today um i've got other things on that have been long planned i would have been delighted to be there but um so be it and uh, i'm very grateful for the the reward I'm somewhat surprised uh, it's normally leaders in real technology the hands-on people rather than people like myself hopefully what's gone on with the post office and the appalling way uh, that uh, people have been treated uh, hopefully that won't be repeated in any other organization going forward i mean People in charge of these types of organisations have got to accept responsibility for what they've done. They really do. I mean, uh, and especially with technology. Uh, and you've got to have the expertise in an organisation to run it. With post office, they never had the level of expertise they needed to bring in a project like this. And they seem only too happy to be led by others, especially the developers, about the technology without having any external oversight on the project, which was utter madness, as we now all see. There was also a total disjointness, I suppose, <laughs> between the management and the executive board and the actual hands-on operators, which if they'd have kept in touch, they perhaps would have heard about these problems at a far earlier stage. But it, the messages used to get lost up and down the line and people covering their back. One of the big problems with the Horizon project when it was brought in, it obviously wasn't tested anywhere near enough. And it should have been. I mean, it went from sort of field testing into rollout with a matter of weeks um, and on such a major thing. And I, I think that's one of the, the problems with all of this. And certainly in the post office case, people know that computers make mistakes. They're not always perfect. The problem or what went wrong with post office is they said the mistakes were the sub postmasters and nothing to do with the system. And they held that position with their lawyer support year after year after year to bring about the scandal which we've all been hearing about over the last few years. I think there's a lot more to come out about all of this and hopefully um, people will learn lessons from it, take away lessons. And I really do hope that those who are responsible for this are held to account. That needs to happen if nothing else is a deterrent to, to other people and other organisations, because it failed, the post office failed, the government failed in its oversight, and the boards failed. It all went wrong. Let's hope it, we don't see this happening again in the future. But again, thank you all very much for the award, and I'll sign off now. Goodbye.